Hi guys, this is Kimberman from Kimberman Gun Plus Studio and today I have here a model kit from Bandai which came from the most underrated Gundam anime series of all time as uh, what I heard or what I uh, search about but this underrated anime is one of my favorite anime which also aired during the 90s or late 90s here in the Philippines it's actually from uh, uh, 2000 something like that year 2000s early 2000s so, uh, it just followed the series of Gundam Wing and Gundam uh, or G Gundam rather so this is none other than the After War Gundam X and as the title itself, this is the main meta of that series, the Season 1. So this is the Gundam X. One of my uh, favorite anime because it's very simple. The story is simple, but uh, I find it uh, enjoyable to watch. It's not that uh, uh, hard to watch because not not really political-ish something like that and I love the character especially the side characters like the air master pilot and uh, the Gundam Leopard pilot but uh, we'll review the Gundam X pilot or the Gundam X mecha which is piloted by Garo Duran so let's check this out The box art here is uh, very nice, very cool looking and it shows also the supporting character, supporting mecha here where in the background you can see the Gundam Leopard which is my favorite, the, my most favorite uh, mecha in the series but I find this uh, hard to get now, nowadays even the high grade which is released during the 90s it's very hard to find and uh, in the background here it shows uh, Gundam Air Master so the, the center of the box we can see uh, Gundam X the main character of Mecha main Mecha so the side of the box we can see uh, the anime uh, clippings here where he is wielding the sword and here we can see him uh, doing the satellite cannon uh, attack there's these knee bends here and uh, the sword uh, slashing pose and uh, the straight build straight build here what uh, it will looks like and in the other side of the box you can see the rear view and uh, the front view of the kit and uh, the the cool reflection or reflectorized uh, satellite uh, plates here for the cannon and you can see here the pilot figure of Garodoran and uh, uh, sitting and uh, standing and uh, not much not much okay so we, when we open the box we open the box we can see uh, some uh, this some uh, pamphlet there which is in I think this is Chinese it's Chinese marking I think but it says here it's Bandai it's Bandai anyway we'll check the runner because I ordered this from China Chinese store this is overpriced but uh, I managed to use my vouchers to make it uh, in par with the actual price or the suggested retail price so the instruction manual here we can see uh, uh, same in the box art we can see the simplicity of how to build this kit and the runners here is not that much uh, it's not uh, uh, hard to build maybe I, it will take me three to four hours to build this depending on the situation and we can see this one the body unit the usual uh, pattern until here we can see uh, the G bits here the Gundam uh, X is uh, 
controlling the gibbets. And we can see some action poses here, the flying poses, and uh, sword, sla sword slashing poses, and uh, the satellite cannon uh, attack. So, so much for that for the instruction manual, it's simple build. And uh, the back page of the manual, we can see the uh, front view and rear view of the kit. So let's go to the contents of the box. We can see here a uh, multicolored runner with uh, the beam saber effect. To be honest, I like the beam saber effect of uh, Gundam X because uh, it has a resemblance to the Gundam Epion's beam saber effect. And we have here white uh, runners and uh, clear purple runners here. We have the satellite cannon uh, plates here and white parts, white runners, another white runners here and uh, blue runners with some uh, purple, clear uh, purple parts here. We have uh, white runners here and uh, some blue runner and gray runner and the last pack here we have uh, gray runners for the inner frame and uh, this uh, reflectorized stickers for the satellite plates okay. so as usual we will uh, review first the runners before we build this so we have here a g2 runner for uh, white color parts and we have a uh, runner e white colored runners for the armor parts and runner F1 white color runners we have here another white colored runners for runner F2 we have G1 runners here for the satellite uh, plates for the gray parts we have here uh, runner C1 and uh, by the way I checked the runners uh, before I proceed for, with this video and it says here made in Japan so it's certified Bandai because uh, I was afraid when I look at this sheet because I think this is uh, Chinese uh, markings Chinese text here because I built or I bought it uh, from China so I was afraid if they are selling me bootleg and they put Bandai, put it on Bandai box. Because I hate bootlegs, to be honest. I hate Chinese bootlegs. Don't uh, buy Chinese bootlegs. It's cheap. But nowadays, uh, I was uh, amazed with this uh, Chinese uh, original kits that they are selling. It is not... Uh, a bootleg of the Bandai kits anymore because they have this original uh, uh, designs now so I managed to buy some and uh, maybe I will put them also in the review because to be honest I don't like Chinese bootlegs it's cheap and it's like stealing from the original don't buy bootlegs to, to, uh, just, a, just a tip but if you're poor uh, you don't have that money you can buy bootlegs but since I have money, I can buy the original. Anyway, uh, I have here H2 runners here. Blue colored runners. And we have here uh, H1 runner for uh, blue colored parts for, this, for the torso. And we have here uh, I1 for uh, clear purple runners. And we have here black. Wow, there's a, a small black runners here for runner K. And yeah, made in Banda, made in Japan. It's Bandai, and there are poly caps here included. So there are poly caps, and we have here a C2 runner for gray colored parts. We have here a I2 runner for purple, clear purple, purple parts, and we have uh, two sets of B runners for the inner frame. So this is a uh, these are colored uh, gray 
And we have here a multicolored uh, runner here for the clear parts, yellow parts, red, and uh, gray parts for it is uh, runner A. And we have here uh, the fuck, it's a little bend, but uh, I like the cool effect of this uh, beam saver. This is for uh, Gundam X. Gundam X style beam saver. We have here uh, satellite panels for the plates. Uh, two sets. And the sticker, reflectorized sticker for the satellite uh, panel. So let's build this kit. 